We turn now to new details in the surprise closure of a health care facility in East Greensboro. So many people depended on the Evans Blunt Medical Center. It closed earlier this year. Well, WFM on News 2's Grace Holland found out what's behind this sudden shutdown. There have been a lot of changes at that clinic, Chad. I talked to the owner today. It's now known as Triad Medical Group. Dr. Shamsher Alawaya says the closure of Evans Blunt Medical Center came after he lost millions of dollars of state grant money. Alawaya says the grant gave his clinic $1 million a year to offset the cost of caring for patients insured by Medicaid. He says that funding was cut in half last year and this year it ended completely. We're still waiting to hear back from the state about why that funding stopped. Donna Odom was a nurse practitioner at the clinic for three years, and she still practices at Triad Medical Group's other sites. She says medical services at Evans Blunt were significantly cut back before it closed. It was only one day a week, which is not appropriate for the patient's needs or for the provider as well. It was not financially feasible for the owner of the practice to have more days of primary care. Psychiatric care is still provided for patients at a smaller office next door to Evans Blunt. It, oh, it is open on Tuesdays from 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. The clinic opened in 2010 in what's considered a medical desert. Alawaya and Odom say they, were noti they notified their patients before primary care ended. Odom is encouraging people she saw to go to the Inspirational Community Health Center where she plans to practice soon. It's very, very important for on a personal level and healthcare level to make sure people are met at their point of need and it saves the system a lot of money. It's much cheaper to go to a provider's office than go to the emergency room. Triad Medical Group will soon move again. Alawaya says a new psychiatric care location will open on Fairview Street on October 1st.